Oh, hey, so glad you could join us. Cumo's getting the next coding word from our buddy Cosmo. Woo! I never get tired of hearing that noise. Excuse me, bubbles in my circuits. Here you go, Kit. The word is variable. Variable. Nice one, Cumo. All computers use variables to track things that can change. What? Things like numbers, names, and places. Yes. Any details that could be different are treated by computer code as a variable. And variables can have different effects on what your device does. Hey, Kit, I think I've got just the thing to help show you the effect of variables. Ta-da! This is my variable challenge for you. I call it Variable Ball! Variable Ball! Variable Ball! You have to score three hoops. Three hoops? With this? I think that sounds pretty easy. Do you think I'm gonna get this? We'll see. Okay, I'm gonna sink this in one. Yeah! Yeah, well done, Kit. That's one point for you in Variable Blow. Let's go for number two. Wait, what have you done to the hoop cubes? <laughs> this is me showing you how variables work, Kit. I've changed the size of the hoop to show how it has an effect on the game. Well. That's good, but this is going to be a bit tricky. That's a miss. That's a miss. Okay, Kimo, I get how this game works. Now it's my turn for a variable. I'm going to change the size of the ball. <laughs> it's a variable ball. Oh, two points to me. Yes, in your monitor. Wait a minute. Where's the hoop gone? Are you cheating, Kumo? No, kid. I've added another variable. Look up. Oh, the variable you changed this time is how high the hoop is. It's in the ceiling. Let's get this. That's <laughs> a miss. I'll get it this time. My new variable is throwing it really hard. Ugh. Careful, kid. That's where I keep the spare balls! Uh-oh. <laughs> so, that's variables. For more coding fun, check out our playlist and the links below. <laughs> Cosmo and friends!